Hello, so you, so you are listening right now, listen with Salish, uh, it's episode 2 I think I guess. When I was at, at the college level, I was thinking more like why these all things have been written. When like reading all those things, you can be like a person which is just like somebody else who has already done all his work and you are left around with this, that secret and you just read that it tried to be like that. So I was thinking what's the matter in, in all these things to be like a copy but you know when you face the day when you when you get off the college and start doing a job especially the job that you didn't like when you join it's it's not it's not so great so when you once get inside and start doing the job that you didn't want but the situation around you make you do that and the whole the whole bizarre thing start just right there so so what you do you meet with thousands of people you meet with every kind of people that you have never expect in your life to come and talk to you so they all started telling their fucked up strategy of how to win this game and 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 you know how to recognize these people especially they always not tell about the the planning you are doing for for the future you and they always think about the situation where you are at and and makes you feel like it's just wasting of time you know i i meet with, with these day i meet with many people these days and they always say what you will do in this job and i say I say all the things about how I'm learning business, I'm learning the customer, how I'm learning what they need and how you can fulfill what they want and can have whatever amount the price you want and you expect from the customers and but they don't even understand so so the map so like when I was in college I had some of my priorities like what to do next but how I will be in my future and and all those things like anybody else but as I as I hit the ground as I face the reality and as I chose what to do first not listening to what the society and the family and the friends and relatives are telling me and buzzing over my head to follow their path so once you not you say i don't care what the fuck you say i'm just gonna do what seems more reasonable to me and you just start doing that so anybody else whether it rather whether anybody like I, i'm not i'm not counting some of the few people that i appreciate in my life including isn't really steve jobs and and some like bill gates mark zuckerberg and all the great technology people and product guys but anybody else if you take an example of any poet like the hardy and i, I don't i don't know but every everyone who has been succeeding in his life and coming to to give people more what they didn't need but they appreciate what they have so they always try to do those special things what seems more reasonable to them not why not do what the society wants them to do so i'm i'm like here so i know what's the plan right now is for the, for the things i'm coming and and if things i'm gonna do in upcoming future so once you learn that you you start doing as soon as you can be so when you fa- uh, and the topic here is when you face the reality when you face hit the ground you you see thousands of people thousands of people telling their bullshit so today the only reason that i stand here and not have been like like anybody else is just like our two little word secret is the people I know I appreciate has always been with me whether in form of technology that Edwards providing is way is me and and you know the books the Walter is Saxon write about the Steve Jobs and the only I think biography and 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 all all those of all those sorts of things that that you can think that kind of motivation it helps a lot it helps a lot really because if those things doesn't exist in this world the 90 the 90 percent of poor for the people will also catch or just just bring into the 90 percent of 10 percent people who is who want to do something and just just they are broke and the things doesn't work in the way they expected so 
so it's it's not if you if you if you want to be a copy of any good people it's still good than those 90 percent so I, I i appreciate i appreciate all the people all the creator that are creating motivational and inspirational content over the internet i appreciate all of you guys because you know the the world the the that very little amount of world is succeeding is is just because of you guys and if you stop working stop putting out the content uh, about the inspiration and motivation the two percent of succeeding people won't be soon so so this is this is this week's kind of podcast to think of what I do based on my reality and and I'm just risking my life I don't know where I will be in 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 two three four five years I don't have any any fucking idea I I literally don't have any idea but I'm just gonna work on a plan if it if, if it did work that's good if it didn't uh, bitch, I got another plan so that's it I'm gonna wrap this here right now uh, see you another week. Bye.